Hello friends, welcome back to Technique. Today we'll be doing a quick speed test comparison of two powerful devices in this price segment. We have the newly launched Poco F6 and we also have the segment best or rather the uh, one of the best smartphones below the 40,000 rupees, uh, the OnePlus 12 one. Now the Snapdragon 8s uh, Gen 3 is the one powering the Poco F6 while this is Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. So both are really good uh, powerful devices uh, below the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3. So let's just go to the about uh, phone on both the devices. So you can just see here about phone. Uh, this is Hyper OS. This is uh, Oxygen OS, and uh, both are uh, uh, really powerful. Android version is 14 on both the devices. We have Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. Uh, this we have here Snapdragon 8 as Gen 3. So these are two devices with really powerful hardware. Here we have 16 gigs of RAM, while here we have uh, 12 gigs of RAM. But that won't definitely make a difference here. 12 uh, is more than enough for uh, most modern smartphone to have really great experience. Now, one of the differences is that uh, uh, this uh, is UFS 4.0 and LPDDR 5X RAM, while this is not UFS 4.0, this is UFS 3.1. So that was one of the differences. So let's go straight into the uh, speed test comparison. Let's just clear off all the background apps here. So there you go. So none of the apps are running in the background. Now next, uh, let's uh, see uh, both are in airplane mode. So there you go, we just turned on the airplane mode on both the phones. And uh, both are connected to the same Wi-Fi network as well. So very similar conditions here. So let's start the speed test comparison of these two devices. So before starting the test, uh, we let our viewers uh, know that both are in the ultimate performance mode. Now we have ultimate mode on uh, Poco F6 while we have the performance mode on the OnePlus uh, 12R. So let's uh, start this test. So we'll just clear off all the background apps once again. There you go. So let's start with Asphalt 9. So let's see which opens Asphalt 9 faster. So here you can see here OnePlus was slightly faster here. Next is uh, BGMI. So BGMI is faster on POCO F6, next is uh, Play Store, uh, OnePlus was slightly faster, Chrome browser, almost same time, Facebook, again uh, OnePlus was a tad faster, Twitter, again OnePlus is faster, Instagram, again OnePlus is faster, Spotify, you can see here OnePlus is again faster, this is taking a bit of time. Amazon again OnePlus is faster Flipkart again you can see OnePlus is faster File Manager once again OnePlus is faster Settings OnePlus is faster YouTube almost same time Gmail again uh, OnePlus was slightly faster here again OnePlus is slightly faster and finally Maps so OnePlus is once again faster here. So you can see that OnePlus was definitely faster of the two. Uh, the Snapdragon 8 uh, Gen 2 is definitely a bit more faster than or rather a bit more powerful than the Snapdragon 8 as Gen 3. So that was the performance testing of these two devices. So you can see here uh, both are really good. Both are Android 14 out of the box and both come with pretty good experience. Now let's uh, see the memory management. So let's open the apps in the reverse order. So as of now all the apps are remaining in the memory file manager flipkart amazon spotify instagram some apps have reloaded here twitter has been reloaded here facebook available in the memory chrome is available play store is again reloaded on poco BGMI has been reloaded on the POCO while it's available on the OnePlus 12 r So memory management uh, OnePlus is leading here. So there you go. So and finally let's go to Asphalt 9. So once again Asphalt 9 has been reloaded on the 
Poco F6. So in terms of memory management, uh, definitely uh, uh, the OnePlus 12 bar was the better option. And in terms of opening of apps, the OnePlus 12 bar did have an advantage uh, in terms of opening of apps. Next, let's see the network speed of these two devices. So let's start with uh, this device. So let's see Poco F6. So the scores are very similar here, so nothing much to differentiate. Now in terms of uh, synthetic benchmark, uh, here we have the Antutu benchmark. And you can see here, this is 14,67,000. This is 14,79,000. So again, uh, there is slight differences here. Obviously, the uh, Snapdragon uh, uh, 8 Gen 2 is a bit more powerful here. So let's just go to the individual scores here. Uh, you can see here. Uh, 3,75,000 CPU is slightly higher but the GPU on uh, uh, this uh, Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 is a bit more powerful than memory score and the UX score here so uh, very similar here um, both are uh, in terms of 14 lakh uh, score now next is the storage test so that's again one of the important tests here so storage test so we'll just test this again so one is uh, UFS 3.1, the other one is UFS 4.0. So that uh, definitely will show up here. So let's see how much OnePlus uh, 12 bar comes up with. So here you can see here, uh, even uh, less than half the score 78,000. Uh, while this is 1,64,000, you can see here UFS 3.1, this is UFS 4.0. So that difference will be there. Now finally the Geekbench test. Let's uh, see the results here. So you can see here 1835 is a single core, 1911 is a single core here, and the multi core is 4624, while this is 5177. So again, very close, but once again, OnePlus 11R has a slightly higher synthetic benchmark in terms of the Geek Pen 6. So these are two really powerful devices. Uh, so obviously, the OnePlus 12R has an advantage in terms of the slightly more powerful uh, processor and GPU, while the Poco F6 is definitely a great device uh, in this price segment, while OnePlus 12R is slightly on the higher side of the pricing so if you want uh, uh, more performance at a lesser pricing obviously the poco f6 excels in that and it also has this advantage of uh, uh, ufs 4.0 storage so that is the performance testing of these two devices hope you enjoyed watching this video which of these devices will you pick uh, if uh, you were to buy one of these in this price segment so do let us know your thoughts in the comment section this is normal signing off thanks for watching hope to see you in the next video have a great day